Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use ChatGPT as the search option on your iPhone when browsing using Safari. Now, I was quite surprised to learn that not many users know you can do this. Over the past several days, Bloomberg has reported that Apple is actively looking into integrating AI search options into Safari, such as ChatGPT, Plaprexity, and many others with the release of iOS 19. But did you know you can actually replace Google on your Safari browser with ChatGPT? Now, if you you've never tampered with your iPhone's browser, then you already know that the search engine or the default search engine is going to be Google. So if you search for something, obviously it's going to bring you to Google search, you'll get all of your results. And you can actually change this on your device. For those of you that may not know, you can go into the application options, head on over into the Safari extension here on your device. So let's go and find the Safari extension, right there it is. You have search engines, the default will be Google as you can see right there, but then you have all these other options to choose from. Now, although the chat GPT option is not available through the search engine options you can actually enable the extension and I'm gonna show you how to do that now the first thing you need to do is obviously download the chat GPT application onto your iPhone make sure you have the app on your device and make sure that you're logged into the application just like so now the next thing you want to do is head on over into Safari so let's go into the Safari browser here and let me show you how to enable chat GPT as your search for Safari. What you want to do is tap on this icon right here on the left and then you want to go into manage extension. Right there it is. So click on manage extension and then you'll get the option. Right there it is, chat GPT search. So make sure you enable chat GPT search. Click done. So now if I go to search for example iPhone 17 just like I did for Google search you'll see that it'll bring me to the chat GPT menu. I can click on go right here and it'll start the search. And now I can use ChatGPT as the search engine in Safari when using this on my iPhone. Now you have additional options. As you see right here, we get all the information. You also have the ability to stop it at any moment. You have the ability to use your voice inputs as well. So you have voice dictation. You also have different options here from creating image, deeper thinking, and all the chat GPT options are available to you right here. You also have the microphone right here for using your voice, as I mentioned. And you can go ahead and input basically any questions or any inquiries here and use the ChatGPT as your primary search on your iPhone right now with iOS 18. So you don't have to wait to iOS 19 in order to use the ChatGPT as your default search on iPhone. Now, if you want to reverse the option, obviously you want to go back here, go to manage extension, turn it off, and there you go. You're back to Google search or whatever search option you have set as your default. And there you guys have it. That is as simple as that to replace Google search and use ChatGPT as your main search on iPhone when browsing with Safari. Let me know what you think about this. Do you like this option? Would would you prefer Apple to integrate more of these options, more AI capabilities into the Safari search options? Let me know in those comments down below. Thank you for watching this quick video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.